roommates did. And because of contact tracing, he was forced to quarantine for 44 days. He said, as an athlete, yeah, you think you're mentally strong? That is a different level of mental strength that you're going to need. Replay. And it will result in a Troy touchdown. Pass is caught from Khalil McLean from eight yards out, and the Trojans are on the board. Great job of awareness by Gunnar Watson. Real on the board. Evan Legassi down and 10 for the Trojans. Watson stands in the pocket. Stood a little too long. And a ball is out and recovered by Middle Tennessee. Jordan Ferguson with the fumble recovery. The redshirt junior out of Atlanta. And the second Blue Raider turnover of the day. Getting a little bit too cute here, going with the double move to the outside. And what you have to realize is the protection is there, but they're trying to do the pump fake and the step up. Takes an eye off of it, and a great job coming to the ball by Cody Smith to cause the fumble. Lean it running back. O'Hara keeps it himself, dives for the end zone. Touchdown, Middle Tennessee. <laughs> Fantastic second effort from the slippery quarterback, Asher O'Hara. This is great recognition by the defense. They actually have him for a possible loss in the backfield, but a second effort gets him into the end zone. He's only six feet tall and needed every inch of it to cross after. And he splits the uprights. Give it to him again. And into the end zone goes Charles Strong. Uh, they went with the double tight end formation to make Middle Tennessee declare what was going to be the strength. Shifted the running back and easy run into the end zone from Charles Strong. Evan Legassi to attempt the point after, and he will kind of ground. Second down and 10, O'Hara. Quick throw up hit middle, and that one is picked off. Intercepted by Craig Slocum, and he has got a convoy in front of him. Touchdown, Trojans. There is a flag back at the 40-yard line. That flag is going to be on the return. During the return, block in the back, return team number two. Ten-yard penalty from the spot of the foul. It'll be first down, Troy. 47-yarder is good for Evan Legassi, who takes over for last year's kicker, Tyler Sumter, who transferred to ESPN. On fourth down, O'Hara tried oh. to get it. I don't know if he did. Uh, we'll see if the second effort got him there, but I believe I saw an official come from the far sideline and hold him here on third down. Pressure comes and dropped in the end zone for a safety. Will Chola, the junior defensive end, just got enough of the shoe of Chase Cunningham, and they pick up the two points. Wow, what a difference it makes, those drop balls instead. We talked about Cunningham does not move quite, bring more pressure. Third and goal, Watson gets it off to the end zone, touchdown. Khalil McClain from five yards out, his second. Exclamation. <laughs> that was a challenge on his defense, keep him off the board, and this Troy football team is coming here in the Murphy. Watson got hit right as he let go of that football. Hey everybody, I'm Wheels. Make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss a video. All right, enjoy the second half highlights. Cunningham, batted in the air, and that one is picked off. Terrence Dunlap. There is a flag back around the 17-yard line. They go with Fidal. 
And there's the signal for the touchdown. Middle Tennessee didn't make it easy. They did not. Reed Blankenship was there to meet him at the goal line, but the freshman doing a good job of staying low, keeping the pad level down, and after the initial contact, able to roll into the end zone. Vidal out of Marietta High School in Marietta, Georgia. Point Beatles with the arms. Well, they're going to see if Cunningham could get something done throwing the football. Spins out of trouble and back across the middle of the field. And that one is intercepted again. And that play should be ruled dead as soon as that helmet came off. But another interception on the back end for Terrence Dunlap. He's having some kind of game. The young man who had to sit out last year because of some academic issues just picked up his second pick of the game. On the field. They'll give him the football and he will get it into the end zone. Touchdown, Troy. Yeah, and that's where I think his niche will be. You know, they say he, he likes to run the ball downhill, can run through some arm tackles. Short yarded situation. That may be a niche in which you can use. Possession of the game and marched it right down the field for a touchdown and really haven't looked back since. And the point after by Legassi. Legassi is good. Knocked off three power five schools for the same weekend. Is that caught for a touchdown? Wow. It will be. Jacob Free looked like he was going to lose the football, gets it away, and the touchdown by Troy. Tyler Hussey with the touchdown. The junior from Troy, Alabama, making a shoestring grab. I don't think that's how they drew it up. In the like a little crossover. Huh? Did that ball go between his legs, or did it just go low? Lella will throw again. This one is caught on the far side, and that'll be a touchdown for Middle Tennessee. Jalen Lane with the touchdown, the true freshman. You had freshman going against freshman out there in the corner. Jalen Lane going against Josh Brown, number 24, the freshman cornerback for. Troy. Twenty eight yard touchdown reception. Those moments for the Blue Raiders today. Nine plays, seventy yards. 